so it's Sunday, April 3rd. We're here at the gas station, getting gas in the truck, um, and then we're gonna go to Lowe's. So I thought maybe I could show you guys what my Lowe's has out um, for plants. Gotta get some bird seed and some fertilizer for Mark's dandelions. Take long suck 20 in there now. Yeah, this truck suck the gas. Yeah, it sucks the gas. You look handsome. Huh? You look handsome. That's how I am handsome. I know. I'm still going to look it because I am. Oh, good. I'm a hot daddy. Oh, yeah. That's what you said. Yeah, don't don't be saying to other people. I'm trying to get other people to see it. Oh, we just a kid. Oh, look, here we got a comic. Whose comic book is this? The world's greatest comic. Ooh, creepy. The Green Goblin. Uh, it's a beautiful day out. We're here at the Walmart on Thin Garden, which is like a real sketchy area of Kingsport. And look at the What's that? $20. $20 no holler. My dad used to say $20 my, my mom used to, my mom and dad both they would say $20 no holler. And then we were at dinner. I'd say pass me a roll for a buck ninety-five. That's about what a roll costs now. <laughs> buck ninety-five. Or my dad would always call me Sprout. Hey, Sprout. My mom always called me Jenny. Still to this day, that's what she calls me. Hey, we kind of match, you know? We kind of match. We kind of match. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we do. Look at this. Elephant ear, giant bulbs. I have never seen a bulb that big. Have you? <laughs> no. That's crazy. Imagine trying to dig that up. And I bet this thing triples in size like a... um. Like a, like a, what do you call it? Like daffodils and stuff? I want one. Yeah. I think, are they full sun? I'll have to do some research on them. Exotic tropical. Yeah, they must be full sun. Oh, look, there's a bunch of berries. They got, they got two for one. Yeah, Gro berries. Grapes. I got, I got plenty of blackberries. Damn big ass bulb. I know, it's huge. I've never seen one like that. You have to dig a big hole. Yeah. Oh, here's that. I mix this seed uh, mix around my garden. I even mix some in your garden. Great for pollinators. You know, my hose um, cracked. That color is really striking. Dianthus. I don't really like Dianthus. There's a little yarrow. Fern like. Yeah, they're itty bitty. The one I grow is they have bigger leaves. And then the flowers smell so good. Mm -hmm. mm. Snapdragons. These grow wild in Alaska. You find these ones. See, so you'll find these that grow. Huh? You'll find these that grow wild in Alaska uh -huh. that look just like this. Man, they got all kinds of color snapdragons. Look at this one. These are like short ones.
And those yellows are bright, aren't they? That's intense. Look, these are cheap. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get me a couple of these. There's little baby snapdragons. They're only a dollar or two dollars. Oh, those are pretty. Yeah, those are really pretty. They're, what are they, violas? Or sometimes they're called different things. They're violas. Look at those, those are pretty. I have these all over my garden. These are the ones that stay, they flower all winter. They don't do good in the summer though, but they do flower all winter. Things? Yeah. Uh, they're in my garden, they flower. I put them in front of my greenhouse door. Do you have that color? No, I don't have that color. It's pretty. It's really pretty. See, they've got these. I've they never. Take full sun. Yeah, see, look, six plus hours full sun. You could make your. I could put. I, I could take that. Um, that container you got, mm -hmm. and put those in them, and you could put it right near your. Uh, your door where you walk in every day. Mm -hmm. You can see them. I'll make you happy. Oh, we gotta get some, um, what do you call it? Some soil. Man, these are pretty too, these little. Man, they smell good. Yeah, they do. I've never seen them like this with the little. Centers. Yeah, how they're like faded. Mm -hmm. They're so pretty. I'm going to get a couple of these snapdragons. There's hardly any of the yellow left. Let's see, I'll get... I know, but that's a lot. And those are $11. These are only two. Here. Put this one in Man, those flowers do smell good. Oh, it definitely smells like spring. Hold on, don't go off yet. This one's got four in it. See, sometimes you can get lucky. You find one of these cans with a bunch of them in it. See, that one's got four in it. I'm going to get those two. See, these petunias, these super petunias are really pretty too. Look at the tiny petunias. Oh my goodness, are those petunias? No, those are bacopa. I've never seen those before. That's actually a really good medicine. That's in a lot of heart medicine, bacopa. Mm -hmm. That'd be good in the medicinal garden. How many, how much of this? Let's go this way, we gotta get, we gotta get a bag of soil. I'll plant those um, violas up for you in that pot. Those concrete pots are nice. Yeah. Sturdy, yeah, this one right here. This is the potting soil I like to make, use because it's got um, yeah. fertilizer in it. Yeah. Oh, the beautiful, I'm right behind you. I'm just filming the flowers. Oh, look at these. Look, they're like long stemmed. Look how big they are. Look, these are pretty. They're almost like those ones you got. Yeah. What is that? They're the violas. Yeah. But look how tall they are. No, these are pansies. Yeah, I got that. I know, I'm just I'm just showing you. Yeah. Very, very pretty. Okay, let's go to the bird seed. Oh, cute. Look at all those hydrangeas. So pretty. What are these? Oh, here's some roses. Don Juan Rose. Don Juan Rose. <laughs> <laughs> oh, story about that. 
can do this. Let's go ahead. Okay. Now they already busted it. Oh. There's a busted bag. Yeah. It's right down there. You see a busted bag? They, the birds look like... Okay, I made it back home. You guys, I hurt my back the other day. Well, it was more like my hip. I've got hip issues. And I was in the garden, like, messing around. And, um... I was kind of bent over pretty far and I heard my hip make this weird deep pop noise and ever since then my hip has been hurting. So I've been walking with a really weird like gait. <laughs> Let me show you guys what I got. Well Mark bought for me at Lowe's. So I got these. I got a Bacopa which is like a medicinal plant that I've never seen offered at my lows before so I was quick to get that one and I got these beautiful snapdragons I don't I have zero snapdragons in my yard and like I like I said at Lowe's they grow wild in Alaska so they make me think of home I also got the 75 foot hose because the my hose I have now it burst and so there's a big hole in it got the sunflower seeds for the birds and Mark and I both got one of these elephant ear bulbs isn't that amazing $13.98 they were so I'm going to be planting that up here in the front but for now I'm going to put some bird seed in my feeders because I've been out of bird seed for a few days now and my birds are angry at me for it so okay now that I got the birds fed um, I'm going to go down to Mark's and help him move his row of daffodils. And I'm also going to plant up a container for him. So let's go down there and do that. But really quick first, I want to grab, I've been addicted to this stuff lately. I don't know, if you're not from the South, you probably have never heard of this stuff before, but it's called like Dreamsicle Fudge. It could be called a lot of different things, but it is called delicious. I know. You're wanting to go outside, but... I gotta go help. Old daddy. In his garden. Beautiful violets. Oh man. Oh man, it's a big old load. Alright, so we got these to plant. I'm gonna plant these in this bucket or this potter from Mark. See these in here, babe? Okay, I got it planted. Look how beautiful it looks. And they smell really good. And they will fill in. So pretty. And then my witch hazel plant. Um, I've taped it because someone stepped on it. I'm going to take him back home. So he's very safe with me. Alright y'all, we're going to go now to Food Lion and get a couple things for dinner. I'm going to be making a homemade chicken pot pie. So, I got my little witch hazel plant here with me. Did a lot of garden work and I'm sweating my ass off. So, let's go get this chicken and puff pastry and get our butts back home. Okay, I just went to the grocery store, um, so I will show you guys what I got when I get back home. Some kind of big commotion. 
every freaking cop in town is rushing towards the four lane. But I just want to show you guys how beautiful it is today. It is such a beautiful day. Ooh, they got their plants out. I should come give them a visit. All the red bugs are blooming. Okay, friends, we are home. Say hello to Jixie. Um, for dinner, we're gonna be making a homemade chicken pot pie. So I got some cream of chicken soup, some peas, some potatoes. Some chicken. I had to close that door real quick. Um, and I also found these, these light actress. I've never been able to find these anywhere. So I found them at my grocery store, eight bulbs for three dollars. Um, I also found my grape hyacinth at the grocery store as well. So every once in a while you get lucky and you find things like that. Jexie, you want to see the flowers? Come here. Look, Jixie. Look. Look at the flowers. Beautiful flowers. I'm so excited for this bacopa. Bacopa is really good for your heart, really good for your cardiovascular system. It's in a lot of, I know uh, it was in that mushroom stuff that I was taking. It had Bacopa in it, which is like good for natural energy and things like that. So it's great. It's a great thing to add to my medicinal garden is that Bacopa this year. Um... So I'm going to start making dinner. I'll probably film a separate video for that. Um, so I can, you know, squish all these videos together and get this up for you guys before it gets too late because this is a Sunday video and I want to get it up by Sunday night so you guys can watch it. Um, I just heard obvious, um, something online sending prayers to my friend Maggie if she watches my videos. Um, her son was in a really bad accident, and so I am sending prayers out. I'm asking all of you guys to send out prayers for Pacey. Um, he really needs it. Uh, they are great people, and I've known both of them for a very long time. So I love you all, and I will see you again soon.